So uh, my name is Yuin. Uh, my uh, nickname uh, is uh, Q. And I play for Evan Marcus and I am the support and the captain of the team. Your name is Yuin. Yes, Yuin. <laughs> Your name is really Yuin. Uh, yes, uh, it's, it's more complicated <laughs> because it's a Vietnamese name, but uh, for the French, I said it's Yuin. That's amazing. <laughs> yeah, yes. <laughs> uh, my name is Simon Tabin. I am the flex player for My Insanity, and my nickname is Dark Mock. I'm Juan Moreno Duran, better known as Vortex. I play 14 Liquid, and I used to play like specialist slash assassin role. My name is Jonathan Ganoshan. Uh, my tag is uh, Wabi. I play for Fnatic, uh, Heroes of the Storm, and I play the flex role. Hello, my name is Thomas. Uh, my nickname is Mene. I play for Team Dintas, and my role is Ranger Assassin. Uh, I would say uh, Pokemon <laughs> because uh, it was very my first. I I spent so much time on this game, and uh, yeah, it was really uh, my favorite first game. I play all the day well, uh, in the bed, etc. Yes, it was really fun. Space Invaders and Warcraft 2. I played like a lot of single-player games like Monkey Island, Final Fantasy. I was really big fan of those two sagas, and then pretty much discovered like Diablo 2 and been playing Blizzard games since then. Um, it's hard to say. I didn't play any like specific games uh, like the big names, but one game I really had love for was uh, Dota 1, and that's why I play MOBA as a job now. Uh, Counter Strike. Just Counter Strike. Anything before Counter Strike? Uh, in that case, it's Counter Strike, World of Warcraft, and then Counter Strike again. Uh, every kind of music, but so, um, uh, more pop music, electro music, uh, something uh, chill, ch chill music, and uh, yeah, uh, something, so some stuff like that. Everything, everything there is from reggae to pop to rock. That can be from any musician or band. Bieber? No. <laughs> Apart from him. Ah, uh, the most aggressive metal ever. <laughs> nah, really. uh, just I don't know. I just listen to chill out. It's it's kind of nice nice for Hero League. You need to chill out a bit when playing. So uh, I listen to K-pop. A lot. Of Fa favorite artist? Uh, Girls Day. Uh, it depends on the mood. Uh, if I'm winning, I guess it's some rap. And if I'm losing. It's chill music to not, I don't know, to not be pissed off and stuff. <laughs> That's it. Uh, I would say it was Naruto 4. Uh, so it was a game on uh, GameCube, a uh, fighting game. But it's not really competitive. Yes, I would say that because I was really young and I play uh, uh, a lot and uh, there was some tournament in my in my uh, city and I, I go into a national uh, tournament and I, I play uh, pretty well. I think that I can see we can say that it was a competitive. Uh, I played League of Legends for about four years, semi-competitively. Um, I played I played high level of Dota 1, but not like competitively tournaments and such. Um, I played like small tournaments in Sweden for League of Legends, but the first game I was really big in was uh, Strife uh, from S2 Games. And after Strife I went into Heroes of the Storm, but yeah, that's... Uh, League of Legends. I would say that I really love... Um, the first Abathur ultimate, when uh, you can uh, copy uh, someone and you have the ulti, the ultimate, so you can make a double Odin, Tychus, some stuff crazy like that. And uh, with the uh, new hero, I think that it was could be completely broken if you have uh, all the ultimate again. And I, I really love that uh, someday uh, they would uh, make the revert and uh, <laughs> think that, that it, it would be really OP. <laughs> Uh, I think it was fun to queue in a bigger party than two for Hero League. Some might disagree, but I 
think it wasn't bad because then you could actually meet good players. Now it's hard. Actually, I would really like the artifacts. I don't know. They were like really cool. I don't know why they were removed. They gave like so many personalization to the to the heroes. It was really fun. I don't think I have anything that I want back, but I remember there was a patch back in the days when they removed Resurgence of the Storm. And when that patch came, I felt, okay, now Heroes is going to be much, much more fun. Uh, probably the copy of Abafir, when you can use Ultimate, when you copy someone. I missed it a lot. Like. I insult <laughs> uh, for me and uh, I, I, would, I just wait, uh, I just make a break for, uh, during uh, 15 minutes, then I go back and uh, I know that uh, after uh, losing streak uh, uh, we, I will win again and make a win streak because uh, yes, a Blizzard makes uh, things like uh, you have approximately 50% uh, uh, of win rate. So know that uh, if I lose a lot, I will win a lot. So for an, in order for me to do that, I would have to lose a game here. And I didn't yet, so... Uh, I don't know, I just like tilt a lot, <laughs> uninstall the game, <laughs> and I come back the next day. <laughs> it's just the best to do. Back to these questions. <laughs> what I do? <laughs> uh, usually, I try to instantly talk with my mate about why we lost and stuff to fix it instantly. Because if you say it some days after, you will forget why you lost. I mean, most of the time. So. I take it uh, pretty cool and I try to fix it with my mate, but uh, I never tilt, not in tournament. Well, my nickname comes from... Well, I choose this nickname on World of Warcraft for my first character when I was... Uh, it was a twink, so it was a, a character for a, a lower battleground. And I choose this nickname from my own uh, first name, you. And I just uh, introduce, uh, add, a, add a later, so the K. And I think it, it sounds great. So I just said Q and I wrote uh, like, like that. And uh, since this day, I keep this nickname and uh, pretty like it. Oh, uh, my cousin's dog is called Mock. And I just edited the dark because I was young, and now it's dark mock. That's like, I don't know, it's something I came up with like 10 years ago. I think it was, I think there was like one guy in Warcraft 3 that had like a very similar nickname. It was like Boshix or something. And then I, I don't know, I found it cool and I kind of like copied it, but with some other letters. But yeah, I just liked how it sounded. Oh, that's a good one. Um, so <clears throat> I was playing Spore. It's like um, EA games, I think. And I went into the where you can see a, a lot of uh, characters that people build. And I saw a character named WUB, like Wub. But in Swedish, it was like hard to pronounce. So I added a B in the end. So it looks like Wub. Um, I, had it for, I had that nickname for on, almost one year. And then I f it felt like it just cuts off. And before that, I had another nickname that started with a Y. And I liked the little Y, so I added it in the end, so like Wabi, because it's a smoother ending of the name, and that's what I stick with. Uh, it was in World of Warcraft, the last boss of Nax Ramas, uh, the first World of Warcraft extension. A uh, uh, weapon name was Might of Menethil, and I took from this uh, weapon. I'd say uh, spring roll. <laughs> uh, yes, uh, Chinese uh, Chinese crepe. Uh, yes, it's uh, it's really with uh, the uh, the sausage, the uh, nyok mam sausage. I don't know if it's this name uh, in English, but yeah, it, it is really good. Pizza. What kind of pizza? Salami, margarita, and tuna. Together? Oh no, but oh, I like them equally well. <laughs> Not together. <laughs> Pizza? What kind of pizza? 
uh, anyone, margarita, pepperoni, all of them. Um, I like Asian food, but uh, I would say I'm a big fan of tacos. Ariabata? It was too hot. <laughs> McDonald. <laughs> Hi everyone, Jarasar here. I hope you enjoyed that latest video. There are going to be more Know Your Heroes videos coming out, so make sure you click like and subscribe to the YouTube channel, and you will get notifications when that happens. In the meantime, I've got two Succubus Kerrigan skins to give away this week, so make sure you click the link in the video description for your chance to win. Good luck, and I'll see you for the next video.